The showdown is not meant to cause offense or harm. The viewer acknowledges any reliance on the accuracy or completeness of said content should be done at their own discretion. The host apologizes in advance for any affront as a result of personal attacks. Always good to have Rob Parker in the showdown. Rob, everybody's mad. Marlins are mad. Bryce Harper's mad. Cubs are mad. We need your calm assessment. Are you ready? For a change, I'm not mad. Not yet, BK. <laughs> not, not yet. You never know. <laughs> All right, so Bryce Harper went ballistic on a check swing call. Does he have a point? Yeah, I mean, you know what? You don't want to get out on that. It was highly questionable. It didn't look like he swung. So if I'm Bryce Harper, I'm mad. And then again, with Angel Hernandez being the guy that uh, ultimately punched him out, we already know Angel's history and a lot of players and a lot of people. We can ignore it if we want. He's not considered a really good umpire, so it's easy to go at him. You know what? My take is it's brutally tough to chill it a check swing from that distance. I, we, we've talked about it. Joe Madden has brought up, hey, we could use try to use technology to see if a guy does a check swing. However, normally a human being or an umpire will make a mistake, Rob, if the swing goes and you don't see it because your eye can't detect it because major league players have such back control. But Angel made a call that didn't exist. Do you know what I mean? The bat never crossed. He could not have seen it. So I can see making a mistake the other way. That happens all the time. This mistake here, here's a good look. He just did not go. So that's, the, that's what bothers me about this blown call. It didn't happen. Yeah. I mean, when you look at it, and of course, you're, not, you're watching it. And once you see the replay, it's very obvious. So I do get that. Uh, uh, live action is a little bit different. But I just think a lot of it has to do with the history of Angel Hernandez as well, uh, more so. Guys blow calls I, I all the time. Yeah, no, but, yeah, I, I, I'm down on that. Like, I just, you know, you didn't get the call right. Could someone have helped out? Um, that's the guy that has to make the call now. I think technology would do it. But there's, a lot, there's more controversial check swing calls than we think because we've started to track them on this show. It's brutally hard. I just hate to see an umpire make it that way where, hey, man, he never, like, even to the live eye, it wasn't close. All right, next thing. But, but here's, yeah. here's the only thing is we, yeah. we can't get into where everything's going to be. Go go to the camera to look. It's got to be you can't do everything. Like I we got to. You wouldn't want to see chess wings. Guys that do a good job. No technology. Do a good job. Yeah, but it, it's, it's impossible from that far, from 100 feet away, to see if the bat crossed the plane, broke the wrist, all that stuff. Come on. The guys are going to get it wrong. You're, any human being is going to get that wrong, Rob. You're right. I just I just wonder how many check swings can we check? Is it one a game right. true. that really yeah. matter? You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, a one yeah. in the first inning that might cost a guy in that bat. That that's not important to him. Good I point. just don't think we can check that. We'll have to figure it out. Uh, but I know what you're saying. Uh, did you see this? Braves Cubs. This is kind of lost out there now. But it was tenth inning tie game. Ronald Acuna steals second. It's his 70th steal of the season. They stopped the game in Atlanta and showed a video montage. Now he celebrates, okay, but they showed the montage 10th inning. The Cubs are fighting for a playoff spot. They had to sit there and watch it, Rob. Pitcher cooling off on the mound, and after the delay, Ozzy Albies walked it off. They're a little upset about that. What's your take? I, I think a video montage at that point is not proper. I don't. I believe that he should stop, take a bow, let the, the crowd go wild for him. Yeah. That's awesome. The video montage has to be after the game Correct. is over. Correct. It is not fair to the other team. And I think to stop the actions, to cool the pitchers down, yeah. to do all that, to watch a video. Come on, what are we doing? Put on the three stooges, my God. <laughs> sake. It is right. It, that is a breach of protocol. You do not do that. It's the 10th inning. That's the game-winning run. You don't stop and say, oh, you know, just take, take. It's not Pete Rose breaking the, the, the hit record, right? That, all right, stop the game for a few minutes. All right, Rob, now this is up there with the turning off the lights thing at stadiums now, right? Don't turn off the lights. That was the Luis Arise thing. We just talked about it here at his ankle when the lights went off because Tanner Scott comes in and they do this pyrotechnics and the, the lights go on and off and he couldn't see the step and he hurt his ankle. He's their best player. He's not playing. It makes, I, wh where are you on this? Like, I'm losing my mind on this. This is another one, BK. I mean, come on. I, I, let's not lose sight of what we're doing here with the baseball. And, and now it's a discotheque. Is that what we're doing? I mean, we don't need to have all of that. I understand you got to keep fans engaged. And, and you got to do more stuff. This is not the old peanuts and Cracker Jacks, and that's all fans want. They want a little bit more. But you can't interfere with the play 
or or make it tougher for players. So right. I'm going to be the old man on the lawn saying, hey, you kids, get off my lawn. <laughs> yeah, I, I think, Rob, if I'm 23 years old, I still don't like that. Like, you know what, I need that. Oh, this is entertaining me. I think I'll come back because I'm, enjoy I'm enjoying the game. I like a little music. I like the video presentations. You can do that without shutting the lights off. Rob, you're right again. Look, you're three for three. I am just, just going to let you go. I'm a thousand. You're All right, I'm ready to go to Cooperstown, <laughs> Brian. And next time you go to Cooperstown, bring me with you. There you go. Robbie, we'll see you soon. Take care. All right, thank you.